ladies and gentlemen, on the red carpet, Suzanne Summers and Alan Hamill. And Alan Hamill. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> we can't go because, you know, of my hip and crutch. So we thought we'd make the hallway our red carpet. <laughs> So I'll, I'll be going by myself. <laughs> He's going barefoot in his tuxedo jacket. You actually look good in your white beater t-shirt. Well, thank you. Yeah, and the sunglasses, and the sunglasses. Oh, here's a tequila. How nice is that? Well, it's award season, so we wanted to see you guys get ready for... Mm. You know, well, yeah. I would just like to uh, salute... A really wonderful tequila company. Mm, okay. Wow. Casa Dragones. Yeah, pretty great. Fabulous tequila. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now, some of it's very pricey, and I haven't bought the most expensive. He doesn't own Casa Dragones. No, I don't. Okay. They're not paying me to do no. this. Okay. No. It's just wonderful tequila. I drink the, the low end, okay? Their low and, end is high end. Yeah. Yeah. Their yeah. low end is high end. Very high end. It's, yeah. It's fabulous, beautiful. So. Beautiful yeah. tequila. Huh? Very lovely. Well, here I have it. But mine's in a Baccarat glass. Okay. Mine wow. Isn't. Yeah. Mine's I it. actually like that. That's a Martha Stewart glass. I like that glass. It's like so that. plain. I, they, I can't find them anymore. They're really thin glass and really, really plain. There's nothing about them. I bet Martha Stewart could find it for you. Mm -hmm. right. You look stunning. Who does? You do. Oh. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. I haven't put on my makeup yet. You well, we're going to do um, makeup, Oscar-worthy, ready makeup. Yep. So the Oscars are in a couple of weeks. We thought you might like to see how Suzanne would do her makeup. Oh, I would do it. If she were going to the Vanity Fair <laughs> party this year. <laughs> I know. Do you realize we've missed everything so far this year? The Palm Springs Film Festival, and we've been invited to some great dinner parties, and Nothing, just me and Al. Yeah, in bed. In bed. You really hey. liked it, haven't you? Yeah. Do you know what's interesting? I haven't gotten bored once. Now, is it because you're just so fabulous? I'm just fabulous and engaging. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go in here. All right, well, I want to put some... Do I want to put my earrings on yet or after? Up to you. Why don't you do your makeup? Because yeah. you're gonna like the, yeah. then I can get the light happen. Yeah, okay. Because right now, right. you're not in your light. No, I'm not. So where are you going to sit, Al? I'm going to stand. Okay. All right. Can I put my glass down on this thingy? Of course. And there's my crutch. <sighs> oh, look. It's like a Suzanne Summer store. It is. It is a Suzanne Summer store. Oh, and it's sort of laid out just the way I want it, the way I wear it. How did that happen? I don't know. Wow. Um, you know, I was somebody... Oh, oh, I was talking to Nathan this morning, and, and I said, um, our makeup, like, this is, this flawless finished makeup, that's what I wear day, night, TV, photo shoots, everything, I always wear it, it's got great, great coverage. Close up for Facebook, mm -hmm. close up for Instagram. Yeah, got great coverage. Yeah. But that, I put that on first, and I've got a little team, let, let me, I like this dark color, dark bronze. I know you think, well, you're so light-skinned and all that, but I don't know, I look, I look better than... I know you're probably wondering what I'm doing standing here, okay? <laughs> Moral support. But every time she puts her makeup on, I put on my tuxedo jacket and sunglasses, <laughs> and I stand here, okay? <laughs> my true. Or she orders me to stand here. I like it. I'm a very obedient husband. I do pretty much everything she tells me you to do. You actually do. You which is one of the secrets. And and one of the secrets to our... Long marriage. I think it is. Okay. I know. I get surprised. I don't like to ask him to do anything for me, but with the crutch, I've got to ask him to do everything. Yeah. And, and yeah. But I'm in control. <laughs> is that what it is? Because you <laughs> like it. <laughs> okay, so I just put the flawless finish. Look at that. I don't look all made up. Great. So really this, great. Is, this is Suzanne's foundation. Yeah, I love it. And I absolutely love it. And you can pull it out on your shoulders, you can put it on your hands so that you're all the same color. One of the tricks in television is to make sure, and you, now that you're aware of it, you'll notice it. If you, Whatever color makeup you put on your face, you've got to do your hands and any other skin that shows. And your neck. And your neck, yeah. And men usually slap it on their face and look at all the white necks. It looks terrible. 
So Can I'm, you just like remind people who don't know about your amazing organic makeup line? I, just, just an overview. Everything you're looking at here is our organic makeup line. Think of what that means. There's not a chemical in front of me. How, how many chemicals and toxins do you take in in a year using uh, cosmetics with chemicals? When you look at your hand under a microscope, I say this all the time, but what we know is pores look like big holes. And then imagine swiping big swaths of chemicals over the, these holes, and then it drops into your bloodstream, and then, and then the trouble begins. And then you've got that stomach problem, right? Or you've got MS, or, or the, one of the autoimmune diseases, and you're wondering where it's coming from. I notice rosacea on TV on people all the time, and I'm thinking, mm -hmm. they we're, don't even we're not realize. Saying, we're not saying conventional oh, no, no. medicine gives you diseases. No. We're just no. saying, why not be toxic? No, you? I'm saying the buildup of, of your toxic burden takes its toll on your GI tract, and your GI tract is, is, is what you're all about. So you know when your stomach's bloated, it ruins your day, right? Mm -hmm. and when you're constipated, does it ruin your day? Constipated? Uh-huh. Are we going to talk about no. constipation? No. No, no, because you will. Um, okay, now here's my favorite thing. So, do you You're, already have your foundation on? I've got. I just put it on. Oh, okay. You know, uh, someone was going to write a book once called Constipation Nation. No. Ah. They never did it. I, I thought yeah. it was a good idea. Yeah. This is um, concealer. Perfect finish concealer in light. You can get it in dark too for dark spots. Okay. Here's why you want conce concealer. This is what every makeup artist in Hollywood knows. What are, you, what are you concealing? I'm creating light on my face. The thing, the reason sometimes I'll look or you'll look good on camera is because the light is great. And sometimes you look like crap on camera, it's because your light's bad. So to be in uh, television and to just go out and catch you know, the light and look really nice, you have to light your face. So you take this concealer here, okay? And you open up your face. You see that? By the way, Suzanne only does her own makeup. Okay. Yeah, is that a good thing? It is a I really miss, good thing. Yeah, but ask Caroline. Because I that, miss the, sometimes. No, no. They're, they're, when you're working after you've done your makeup, yeah. you have, we have a makeup person there to do a little fluff and puff. Yeah. But, no, but sometimes I, Caroline comes in, she goes, she takes the sponge and, and blends There was it. a while when you yeah. really stopped yeah. giving a crap. Yeah. No, the when you were living yeah. here, remember, and you came into L.A. Yeah. And we were doing a shoot, yeah. and I was like, see, then you got to put makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> we bounce back and forth in one another's lives. Sometimes she's my mom. That's so um, funny. No, the, no, last, it's also you know, the, the last makeup artist uh -huh. who did you, you looked, uh, I mean, it was beautiful. Oh, yeah. But it wasn't your face. I don't know whose face it was. Oh, but uh, the guy who did the cover oh, the cover was, was amazing. amazing. Oh, the so cover, natural. yeah. That oh, was yeah. the best makeup. Yeah. That yeah. He was, I have to say, mm -hmm. you do a really good job. Yeah, no, he, no. He was. He got it. He did it better. Because I looked like me. Exactly. Like the best version of me. That's, we're talking about the cover of A New Way to Age yeah, for so many that? of you. I saw that um, in the... Uh, Simon and Schuster building in New York. They've got that whole the lo whole lobby is filled with shelves of my books. It looks oh, really awesome. good. Where's the book? Okay, so I'm taking my time here. You know, you could do this in seconds, but you see how I've I've lit up my face there. Okay, can I show them the colors? Please. Of yeah, the and there's that. We we have two colors yeah. of the concealer. Yeah, this is this is the light medium is on the left. That's what Suzanne is using, and the medium dark is on the right. So you want to get it like one shade lighter than your skin tone. Obviously, yeah. we could have many more colors to fit a variety of colors for women. But we find these two cover many people in the mid-spectrum. And I'm sorry we can't have more colors for everyone. The minimums are really high on makeup. Right. And um, we just can't sell through it. So I apologize that we don't. You know, we have four colors of foundation. We need, you know, 15. If you've got like a dark spot, though, that you... You want it? You could use the you could use the dark concealer for. You know, it's all about like being a painter. You're painting. You're painting your face literally. So if it were me, I would get the light concealer and the dark concealer. If I was only getting one thing, get two things. Get the flawless finish and the concealer. 
okay? <laughs> the rest, she kind of lived with me. This is like, to me, what's special about our line. Suzanne's okay, foundation like to, like is the... To, oh, I'd ahead. like to just mention Suzanne's current book that was just published. He's so sweet. And <clears throat> what I'd like you to do, Suzanne... Yeah. What are some of the issues that people have mm. who will find the solution for those issues in the interviews that you, with the doctors in the book, plus in the back of the book, and this is really valuable, all the testing that you need done, we tell you exactly where to go to get it done, and it'll be less than if you do it at a regular place. And what else is in the back of the book? And once your results come in from, the, from testing, whether it's blood, urine, saliva, or stool, once it comes in, a health professional will sit with you on the phone, go through every line item, and explain everything about either high, low, or perfect. Okay, this when we go up. out to dinner parties, because he's married to me and I'm the bioidentical hormone guru, I, I'll look at him across the table wherever he's sitting. He's always sitting next to some woman and they're deep in, in conversation. When I get in the car at the end of the night, I go, hormones? He goes, yep. <laughs> I have a bunch of people jumping in asking where they can get the makeup. It is only available at SuzanneSummers.com. Use the promo code OSCAR30 today and you'll get 30% off um, everything in the cosmetics category. We have a couple small retail chains where you can find Suzanne's makeup as well um, at Clark's down in the desert. Um, we hope you check it out. Palm Desert. Okay, I'm using our mascara. You know what's great about our mascara? There's no glue. Did you know there was glue in mascara? That's how it stays on. And so you can get this. It's all about patience with mascara. You just keep putting it on until you get it on thick enough. Um, this I, is a very silky finish on this mascara because it very, doesn't have the glue, so you do have to be a little patient with it. But Yeah, yeah. some people say, oh, it's so wet. But that's just because it's, it is. It's wet. It's no glue. Okay. That's enough for right now. All right, um, this is fun. I was saying to Alan tonight, you know, when I was a kid, what I loved doing most was playing dress up. And my favorite game was playing doctor. <laughs> <laughs> you like to get dressed, he likes to get undressed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's why you guys work well. <laughs> so this is, this is awesome. This yeah. is all you need. I swear, this is all you need. <clears throat> She's talking about our quad eyeshadow. It has four colors. You can go day to night in this. The top left is called Flesh. Top right is called Nude. The top left is Cocoa. And the top, the bottom right, I believe, is Espresso. So Suzanne's going to show us how you can go from natural to smoky glam. Well, I've sort of got, I mean, with eyeliner and just a little bit of shadow here, that's sort of the natural. But what I, lo what I love the most... I love to get them all dark and smoky and sexy. You oh, like yeah. you like, I like eye that. makeup. Alan like loves yeah. eye makeup on yeah. women. He loves it. Well, not on all women. No? No, it, it enhances the eyes. I mean, look at... Yeah. I'm smoking up these eyes here. Always leave a little on your lid, either on, with the clear, you know, you can put the clear on here. It just... It's like... Do you see it makes like a light? Yeah, it looks great. Yeah. Um, while Suzanne's finessing that eye, I just want to address a couple of your comments about shipping. Um, we had a delay in manufacturing on our Gut Renew product, which has been yeah. such a huge hit. This product comes from Australia. As you know, Australia has been through oh, a few people. very difficult months. So people. we did have a difficulty in getting that product in on time. It is in now, and those products are shipping. We apologize profusely for the delay, and I'm sure you all understand, given what has happened with Australia. But they have amazing organic products yeah. and that's where we sourced many of the ingredients so thank you for your patience and um, you guys should have received an email if your order is delayed with a special discount code um, because we we hate disappointing you but I apologize for that okay see what I just did I'm just working out of this little thing I don't need any more than that can you do me a favor is it too hard for you to spin around so I can just get a closer yeah. look on your eye can you see my eye that you don't have any light on yeah, you got to go the other way. Yeah. yeah. I'll lean in. I'll lean People in. want closer. Yeah. But what I like is that when I travel, what a cool thing it is that I just have to bring this and not like tons of different color shadows. And then I, when I want to create that light here, I just dip that. Just, you, you know, using your finger. 
See, See is the does? light one under the brow and right at the right, right in the middle of the right. lid? Okay. So this light one, I already put it on there, but okay. And then the dark in the crease. Yeah, dark in the crease, and then smoke it up. I bring it out. Do you wet this? Because no. you can go wet or dry, right? Yeah, I use it dry because I can control it better. But try, okay. it. try it both You ways. can use wet if you want to use this as right. a liner. But I, um, I put a little bit of liner on that's not ours because we're not making the liner right now. But I put this over it. And see how nice and smoky that is? I have requested new liners, P.S. Yeah, I'm good. I'm working on it. Good. Okay, so now I'll go over here. Oh, this is really important. Don't forget this one. This is huge. Take your brush with just a little bit of the color on it, okay? And bring it down the brown. On both, on the, with the brown. And then, so you don't look like you have brown lines. Or you have that desert shimmer, which you use as contour too, right? I do, but I use, I use it here. But on my eyes, uh, uh, I mean on my nose, I like to kind of... Oh, this is so nighttime the, nose. So use the brown shadow yeah, on your nose. This is nighttime okay. nose. It's a contour. Okay. And cut your nose off. I don't have a long nose, but it just so, d does something. You have what a perfect nose. What do you have to cut your nose off I for? I don't know. I don't know. I didn't know I had a nice nose. You know, you don't know what you have. Until no, I've always told you you have a nice nose. Yeah, you did. I, I know, thought... because my kids got it. God, they, they're so beautiful. I don't wow. Know <laughs> hey, did you see that article that was posted? No, I... Your, uh, the picture you posted of us in our leopard outfits? Oh, I didn't see an article. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it got picked up. It did? Yeah. Suzanne Summers and her daughter-in-law and gorgeous grandchildren. Oh, I'm so glad. Yeah, where super where cute. is that? I'll show it to you. Oh, I think I'm we so we glad. posted it on Facebook. Oh, I'm so glad. Yeah. Very cute. It was so cute. Cheryl wants to know how you keep eyeshadow from falling on your face. Falling on your face. I have some tips. Some yeah. people will do eyes first and then do the foundation after because oh, you know when that oh, eyeshadow like oh, oh, you mean do sprinkles it, on oh, your cheek oh, and I then it you, like yeah. messes up your cheek. I or that, yeah. you can take a tissue and you can lay it under your eye when you're doing the shadow. There's a that little folded tissue. But I didn't I mean I've got the foundation on, I didn't get any Yours didn't and also no. blow on it when you when you first dip the shadow brush into the makeup, blow on it before you apply it. Yeah, blow on it. Okay, now. So I, so I want you to go to bed tonight with all your makeup. And the dress. And the dress. And the dress. Hey, hey. Yeah. That way you wake up in the morning and your makeup and, and I you will be wonder smeared what happened. Oh, I love that. And I love what happened? That. Say, hey, Don't you? did yeah. we have a night or what? Yeah, and what happened at the Oscars? Yeah. yeah. I like that walk of shame look. Yeah. Skanky. That's yeah. the word you use. Skanky. Well, skanky. Right. Skanky. That's like that night we stayed here. It's, it's five in the morning and you have your shoes yeah. in your hand. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's exactly. That. Remember that night we um, <laughs> didn't plan to, but we ended up staying overnight at the Copelsons and we'd been to a fancy <laughs> thing. And I was telling Caroline we left in the morning in their mansion. I'm holding my high heels and walk a makeup shame. all over. Walk a shame. <laughs> no, but it's weird when you see a woman on the street like uh -huh. that. Yeah. And yeah. you know she had a major yeah. fight with her whomever, okay? And he or she said, out. No, it doesn't mean a fight. It just means you're trying to get out before morning. Yeah. You're trying to get out oh. before, oh. They're, before oh. their roommates wake oh. up or before oh. your dad wakes up. Yeah. <laughs> I used to sneak into my Not that I've ever house. done that, guys. No. Not that I ever have done that. It was definitely more than 35 years ago. Okay, this is an R pencil that I got sort of a, it's called chicory. All right, put that on because I want to now start layering our incredible lipsticks like this one here, which is... Um, which one are you looking for? I'll tell you where it is. Uh, is this, which one is that? Very Pop? That's Honey Glow. Honey Glow. I want to see that color. Because I left the bottom lip. I just lined. When you leave the center of your bottom lip uh, light like this, it makes you look like you're more like that. Mm. Uh -huh. I mean, can you see what that does? Mm -hmm. Al, can you see? Yeah. Beautiful. Not quite right yet. Let's keep playing. And your caramelized peach is yeah. on the far right. This one here. Yeah. I always go for that. I love it. Okay, we might, might have had that there. Now, what did I grab here? Very pop. I must be in a festive mood. Okay. This is weird. 
You're the one you always make fun of my weird ass family, Caroline. Mm -hmm. This is weird. It's our weird ass family. Yeah, what's weird? Yeah. 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 It's not your weird ass family. I'm getting it's there. Our. I'm almost ready. And it wouldn't have taken this long. I'm just enjoying it. You know, putting on makeup is fun. Um, the girls have always loved putting on makeup. We do. And now our moms can't get mad at us. We can put on as much as we want. And it's a question to ask when you're dating. Do you like makeup to your potential whatever? Because <laughs> if they don't, you're not going to have as much fun. Actually, do you remember the first question you asked me? What? Oh, do you like sports? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to see if I can tuck in. What did I closer. say? No. Nah. I'm not really into it, but yeah. you had been the announcer, like Jim McKay here, for the CBC. That was cool. You've had such a career. I know. He was the guy. He was the voice of the Canadian Olympics. That's why. Well, I don't know if I was the voice. Well. There were other people. <laughs> when I see, I know, but when I see pictures of that, I only see you. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, now, I tried to zoom in a little. Do you guys like that better? There we go. Yeah. What I need now, though, you could go get them, are my what? earrings. Do I know where they are? I do. Okay. Which ones do you want? Kathy Waterman? Chandelier? No, I'm going to wear um, cheap rhinestone. Oh, okay. Because I, I, there's something like... I'll bring you some choices. I'll, but they are right in a blue case, right um, on the other side of my island. And I've got a, a diamond ring there. <laughs> a diamond ring? Oh. She wanted to come oh. first. She always comes to Caroline. Hi, Hi Gloria. Baby. Oh, you're Hi. so this, pretty, You want a little Gloria. makeup? Look at this so cute pretty, baby. Gloria. She is Oscar ready, too. Yeah, isn't she? <gasps> she has her beauty Look at her mark. makeup. Your Look parents her tried to remove your mole when you were a baby, and I said no. <laughs> I said it makes you more beautiful. Look how pretty she is. Look, you are... Yeah. You are happy. Yeah, eyes open for Not a Not squirming. Time. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Okay, well, that's say it. Say it, yeah. you lose it. Right. That's it. Want her? Yeah, I can't. Can't do her one-handed? She'll jump off my what shoulder. What kind of a parent are you if you can't do anything one-handed? <laughs> <laughs> she sleeps with me. I mean... I don't feel jealous cash. or anything, yeah. but she kind of shows a little more affection to you than to me. Yeah. She's more concerned about me since I've had the crutch. You know how animals do that? Gloria follows me everywhere when I get out of bed, when, wherever I go with that crutch. But when she needs a little consoling herself, she goes to you. I'm glad she has mm -hmm. that. We have an understanding. I like it. Yeah. And she makes eye contact with me. Yeah, she just okay. made eye contact yeah. for, the, for the folks out there. I have no idea if these are the ones you wanted, but I took a guess. Uh -huh. Is it these? Yes. <gasps> really? They are. If you guys knew how many thousands of pairs of earrings were in there, you would be really impressed by that. I'm really impressed. <laughs> but isn't the, aren't these the perfect earrings with this dress? They are. Because to wear my Kathy Waterman, they are actually too low-key. You know what I mean? Ah. And you're all about proportion and balance. Yeah, you absolutely. Me that. Absolutely. What's the matter with you, Gloria? See, it's the right. It's the right. Gloria's a little shy. Mm. Yeah. She's being pretty good, man. This is... That's a long time. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not staying much longer. Mm -hmm. It's okay, yeah, you can hear, Gloria. It's okay. You can hear the, the whining is starting. What? What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Meow. She attacked me yesterday. I know she did. Okay, did you put blush on yet? I just did. Do I need more? No, but we just didn't talk about it. Oh, no, I did here with the, okay. um, I did the uh, berry pop. Okay. Normally in my everyday life, daytime life, I wear caramelized peach. Okay. So you might think about both if you have Maybe I colors. could just pop in here and just show the colors of yes. blush. Yeah. And I also, oh, Whoa. I'm so sorry. I mean, it's it's okay. a beautiful display. I also um, didn't talk about this much but you know when you got a little a little foof and a, a, oh, a color and a spot yeah. you can use it for other things too you can use this as a um, highlighter too yeah we call it an eye primer but yeah it's basically cover stick and an eye primer right. stick so you can use it for anything but and yeah. you know when you're real tired um the concealer is what pops your eyes 
Yes, go on, Al. No, I was going to say, you knock some stuff off the table here. Yeah. So, <clears throat> yeah. If I had to, if someone were to say to me, mm -hmm. what yeah. is Suzanne's worst habit? Mm. I couldn't think of one. Okay. Mm. Mm. But what has what has happened over the last while? Mm -hmm. You have a table next to our bed mm -hmm. on your side. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, you reach for things in the dark. I do. <laughs> and they fall off the table. I hear crashing and banging, and sometimes, <gasps> sometimes a whole bottle of water <laughs> falls off your table. I can, I can hear it. Okay. And then in the morning, I'm like the cleanup guy. Okay. I'm down on my hands and knees. What the hell is this? <laughs> Well, our whole life is on that one damn table. I know. My whole life. Like, six I weeks. I, no, it's now we're going on eight weeks. Really? Mm-hmm. Think of that. It's crazy. I want to show you something that we don't sell. Something I want my daughter-in-law to source for us. A white eyeliner pencil. Mm -hmm. This is a Hollywood you know, trick right here. Yeah, here's... here's. You know, when you wore eye makeup when you were on... <clears throat> I can't remember whose show you were on. Uh-huh. I don't know if it was the lighting mm -hmm. or the white eye makeup. Uh -huh. Your eyes look really strange. Yeah, that was bad light for me, though. I remember that show. Yeah. Okay. You like it or you don't. Anyway, I want Caroline to source it because I think it's Okay, like, I'll see. Haven't I had fun? Okay, I just want to show these blush colors. Mm -hmm. Alan, can I pop over here and just Certainly. get an over-the-shoulder of the blush, please? I'm going to go so, get the other two parts to my outfit. Oh, okay. And you talk to them. All right, so left to right here, I'm going to start with Facebook. Um, the cameras for Instagram and Facebook, I apologize for when oh, you're off camera. This is Coral Crush. That's so cute. Thank you. Suzanne loves that she color. Very, very pop. A little pinker. Honey glow. A little lighter. And this is antique rose. Um, for some reason, we don't have the caramelized peach. Um, and the lipsticks that match are right behind. We, we sell caramelized peach. I just don't have it on the display. And this is the multi-stick, which comes in sunrise. Same thing for Instagram. Coral crush. Very pop. Okay, I'm coming right behind Honey you. Honey Glow, yeah. Antique Rose. They all have matching lipsticks. Here's that, that great eyeshadow that Suzanne used, the quad. This is our bronzing powder. Comes in Desert Shimmer. You can use that as a contour, or you can just use it to warm up the whole look. You've got our powder. It comes in light medium or medium dark. And that amazing concealer also comes in two colors, light, medium, or medium dark. These are the four colors of foundation. Porcelain light is on the left. Natural sand is in the number two position. Honey uh, is in the middle there, in the third. And the fourth one is bronze, dark bronze. So that's porcelain light, natural sand, honey, and dark bronze. And again, I apologize for not having more colors on the... On the makeup for the foundation, um, we have such a high minimum that we've we've picked four colors that are the best selling couple colors because otherwise we just have so much waste. We sell a few and then we don't go through the rest of them. So we haven't been able to find a way to get smaller quantities. I am working on it because I really hate that we don't have more colors to fit a variety of people. Am I coming in here? Or are you coming back to me? I was going to go in there because the lights probably, but you can. Come well, I can turn. I can plug in the light. Okay. Hold on, I'm going to stay on Alan. Okay. Wait for your reveal until I... The connection's not good in here. It's the bathroom. No. <laughs> here they come. I know. Mr. and Mrs. America. <laughs> wow. Mr. and Mr. Mrs. Ready for the... I mean... Ready for the Oscars. we chill on the red carpet, wouldn't we, Al? Look at us. Yeah. You know, we, you know we, we need a red carpet down this hall. Let's get one. Okay. Yeah, let me peel. Okay. I'm not sure about the green gloves. What do you think, Caroline? I think, you know what I think you should do? What? Take off the green gloves. Yeah. And put on the, the, the little, little hat. hat with the net. I don't know about the hat with the net with the, um, the little fur cowl. No, so maybe okay. the fur cowl is wrong. I know, you're pretty great to me. Yeah. Hmm. You just touched my boob. Pardon? You just touched my boob. Isn't that part of the deal we can make? <laughs> Huh? HB Fun said no green yeah. gloves. Oh, She's no, right. no green gloves, yeah. yeah. I know, as soon as I looked at it, I went, something's wrong. 
Where's yeah, your little hat? Right. It's in there. You'll see on top of the little top hat. They think you look awesome. Marilyn wants to know if the powders, if the powder makes your wrinkles look more pronounced like other powders. I don't think so. I don't think so. Let me see. Because so. Suzanne's makeup blends into the skin. It's mineral makeup. So I love this. It's all mineral. So what happens is that it blends it's into your skin tone. Piece, don't you? Well, let's, let's see. All right. Can you take one step to your yeah. right? I love the veil. You know what I call a veil? veil? Yeah, yeah, veil. Pretty cute. This is how me and Al have fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is too much. Yeah. I'll show you. Okay. I know about proportion and always take one thing off. Okay. Okay. All right. Nancy said, no need for neckwear. The gown is enough. I agree with yeah, and then the quiddity gold said the same thing. No scarf. Yeah. Okay, that's great. Yeah, that's there you go. Great. Yeah. And I have a little sequin purse. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're ready. Am I ready? You are ready to yeah. walk to bed. I. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Looks well, good. Oh, one more thing. What's that? Well, I was just looking at my shoulders with all this glitz here. Oh, yeah, some glitter. I haven't put um, bronzing, bronzing on my shoulders. This is great stuff. Bronzing shimmer. Bronze shimmer. Yeah. Okay. All right, some of that. Just oh, yeah. a little. Oh, yeah. Just a little. Okay. So Maybe I want you to go to bed like this tonight. With the hat and the earrings? Everything. All right. Patricia said the gown is outstanding. <laughs> and Funnigan said she used that bronze shimmer today. D uh, Denise Finnegan? No. Oh. Oh. Well, that this this is great. I put this on my legs. You know, I'm a white Irish girl, but... A little bronze looks real good. And also, can you can use this, and you also yeah. have um, can then you you show have multi stick, yeah. the multi stick in sunrise. Oh, I love the multi stick. So now is when I'm starting to play. How fun is? Oh, that looks good. That like brings it together. Wow, that's. It gives good. you a little highlighter. Yeah, this is that. Yeah, there was something missing. I kept looking. Oh, away. that uh, Finnegan is Denise Finnegan. Hi, Denise. Hi, Denise. Hi, Denise. This wow. is um, this we, is our weird ass show, Denise. That's right. We mm -hmm. love we love Denise. Yeah, yeah. Oh God, we laugh so much in New York. E.J. Meyer said, "You are you're such an encouragement to us older ladies." <laughs> How old is she? I don't know. How old are you? Nobody's as old as I am now. I am. Yeah, actually, you are. Yeah. yeah. Let's oh. give Al kudos too for being so handsome. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's an outfit. <laughs> so now you know what we do. We at five o'clock we have a drink and we either go to the bar or dress up or I wear a negligee to bed and we eat soup in bed. <laughs> it's great. Sometimes the kids come visit. Sometimes I love. Chris is really sorry visit. he couldn't come I know, today. I know. He has a big project due. This is I'm the so multi stick. Happy for him. This is the multi-stick multi -stick in Sunrise. Great. You can use this on your cheeks, your lips, your eyes. Just gives your face a little light. It's also a great no makeup look when you don't want to wear too much makeup. Super natural. And you know this. what our powders are made of? Tapioca uh, powder and bamboo powder. Okay, so, so I have... So like, like, what about that okay. would hurt you? What? If you are, if anything that you're using is talc, you guys know the gig yeah. is up on talc. Yeah. Cal Talc is now a known carcinogen, and all sorts of people are, there are all sorts of class action lawsuits against talc. So Could I be hopefully little, you're not using any talc. Please. But I started writing about the dangers of talcum powder in uh, the sexy years. So what was that, 20 years that ago? That was a long time ago. Yeah. Wow. Suzanne is always ahead of the curve. She takes a lot of arrows, but she says stuff <laughs> no. before everyone says it, and they're like, that's not proven. You don't have the research to back that up. How do you know? So, and then 20 years later, 
They yeah. finally come around and they you know go, it. oh, we did some research and guess what? <laughs> Talc is carcinogenic. So I had, I, you mentioned thinking. tapioca. Okay. Oh, tapioca. Why did you mention it? Okay. Because, oh, tapioca powder is in our powder. Okay, yeah. right. Because in Stop our putting. pantry, we have four boxes of tapioca. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it's the small tapioca. I don't oh, like the small tapioca. I'm so sorry. I like the big ones. God, I'm sorry. God. Okay. You know what? My husband also gets on me for not making him tapioca pudding. Are you kidding? Yeah. And it's a problem because yeah. I don't like it. <laughs> yeah. I love tapioca. So pudding. does Bruce. He loves it. And I like to fill my mouth with the big ones and just. Go. I, he likes those. You must have taught him this because he loves those big pearls. Was it a was it a boo boo thing? No. No, I because I, I was dating him. I would make it for Alan all the time. Cause okay, so well, well Bruce I loves nabbed, it. I hadn't nabbed him yet. <laughs> Bruce loves it, and those I are the find big ones. I, I I will find those tapioca pearls in my pantry, and they're like, Take your husband <laughs> some tapioca pudding, but he's not eating any sugar this month. So oh, that's right, he's on dry January. Dry and dry January, no sugar, and the thirty day yoga challenge. Right. Do you think he's a little compulsive? A little compulsive. Yeah. Uh, when Bruce was a little boy. Uh, it was all about his sock drawer, mm -hmm. all about the sock drawer. And it was so beautiful. The, the whites all lined up perfect in the darks and then the colors and the prints and then the ones with the cartoons on them. Let's have a toast to Bruce, who is not drinking tequila. Okay. Oh, yeah. You're, you're glad you're not here, Bruce. <laughs> Casa yeah. Dragones. Yeah. It's really nice tequila, I have to yeah. say. You know what's great about this? You can drink it and drink it. And, and then die. And then no, I'm only kidding. <laughs> and you don't really. No, you don't get. You don't get whacked. No, because it's a stimulant. Tequila is a stimulant. Yeah. It's not a depressant. Yeah, that's right. You don't get whacked from it. That's what yeah. I like. Yeah. No. Um, Nutrition with Sandy said, looking at this video, one can't believe they are looking at a woman of 73. My mom is 74, and it's inconceivable the difference. No offense to her mom. P.S. Mm -hmm. But. Yeah. It is true. You look absolutely amazing. Well, I really walk my talk. Denise Finnegan was on the tour with me, and she knows. Um, I believe in what I write about, and I'm, I've am i used my fame to get to the best and the brightest who know how to do it. And it's all for me. I only go to drugs when I absolutely need them, but I'm not against them at all. I think when you need drugs, they are a godsend. Uh, but if I can go natural first, that's my whole that's my whole vision on everything. If I can go natural first, if I can with cosmetics, if I can put non chemical um, makeup on that has uh, efficacy. I mean, I don't think that when you all leave me, I'm going to go put on the chemical stuff. I, I look nice. Yeah, you look beautiful. Yeah. So um, wouldn't you rather try this first? And then if it doesn't look good, then you go to the chemical stuff. So that's, well, that's how today, I, Today's a good day to try it yeah. because everything is 30% yeah, off. 30 you off. can use this promo code OSCAR30. It's all at SuzanneSummers.com. And just go to the cosmetic section. You can see all the colors. We have color swatches of everything. If you end up with a color that's not right for you, you can totally return it. Yeah. We're very good about that. We know yeah. it's hard not to be at a makeup counter and try the colors. Right. I tend to use two different colors, and I kind of blend them. Like for me... I'm kind of medium tone color, so I get the honey and the sand, and I mix those two colors depending on oh, how that, tan I am from the summer. You're talking about the flawless finish makeup. On the foundation, yeah. Right. yeah. And yeah. I use the uh, the dark bronze, which I know I... I sometimes I, you use honey, though. Sometimes I use honey, yeah. Yeah. But I like I like giving myself a little tan. Yeah, Suzanne wants to be like a suntan California I do. girl. I do, But this dark bronze... Um, you know, this will go to a much, much darker skin tone than certainly than Suzanne has. Yes. Um, oh yeah. Remember Brenda? So. Or Brenna. Brenna. Yeah. Oh no. Beautiful. That, no, she was, she was the, um, She's incredible. <gasps> yeah. So pretty. Yeah. So, um, you have a lot of choices here today and wow, you look good. Do you want to, do you want to, uh, recap on anything? You want to go to bed? You want to keep drinking? What's your What's your pleasure? I want to um, have one more drink, the three of us, okay. not on camera. While and the dinner is ready. Oh, great! We're having um, like a fricassee of chicken with um, uh, shallots and and mushrooms over. Did um, you say fricassee? Wild rice, yeah. Yum. That's yeah, doesn't fricassee monitor. have like giblets and necks and all that stuff in yeah, there? Yeah, but the, yeah, this is just like a toned down version. Oh, okay. Yeah. Why, when you were saying giblets and things like that, you were running your hand against your penis? 
What? <laughs> but we're just now. You're going, does he, can does he you have giblets up? and things? Can you stand up next Did to Did you Alan? see him do that? <laughs> I missed it because I was repositioning. Yeah. You said, you said. <laughs> Thank God. You said, doesn't Frankenstein well, have giblets and yeah, things? So. Right? That's not where your giblets are anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you look over here. Okay. Look over here. So now we're now. going to the party. Okay. And we actually, better watch some movies. Actually, you know what? Now the sad part starts. What? Okay. But what? you can look at me instead okay. of the mirror. The, it, we're over here. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, I was we just getting the light from there. We yeah. don't have a party to go to. No. We're these two lonely no. people. <laughs> I give your own party. Are in our little place. Okay. Yeah. We have no place to go. All dressed up, no place to go. And what are we going to do? What do we do? We get into bed. We get into bed. Get into bed. Probably yeah. the next show will be from bed. If you don't know what to do, you get into bed. Yeah, especially okay. if you have a crutch. It's so fun to not be in bed, so you might as well get in bed. We We're actually we back tomorrow morning at we 11 a.m. We We're going to do a great show on hair, skin, and nails. She's following me everywhere, so I don't know oh, where I'll go. When, when yeah. are we doing that? Tomorrow morning at 11. Yeah. Okay. 11 Pacific. Yeah. We 11. should do one from the pool. Why? At some, uh, not tomorrow, but at some point. Because I, I want to do my exercises in the pool. Okay. With the, Are you uh, allowed to exercise in the pool now? Yeah. The physical therapist today said that would be good. You can walk in the pool and do things. Oh, okay. So, like loosen it all up. It's here, and I'm swollen right there. And when that is going down every day, a little bit, and then, and then I'll be better, won't I? Suzanne fractured her hip, for those yeah. of you who don't know, so she's been rehabbing for the yeah. last eight weeks. Don't fall. Don't fracture. If you have to do something, break it. It's much easier, yeah. as, as per the doctor, because then they just do a hip replacement with a fracture. You've got to wait till the bone grows back. And bone has very little vascularity. It takes a long time for bone to grow back. And so the, you're, you're left with, from the doctor with, don't fall. Yeah. And don't move. And you know what really helps? What? Tequila. It has. It really has. Yeah. It has. I wait yeah. till 4 or 5 o'clock so when that we can in, like... When she's in a little bit of pain, mm -hmm. it's either take a pain pill... I'd rather do that than a pain pill. This. Yeah. I would also... Yeah. I would also like to ask our community... I would really like to ask everyone to put in a very special prayer for Suzanne's hip healing right now. Mm. I would really like Thank to ask you. everyone just to take a minute and put your energy mm -hmm. and ask out loud mm -hmm. for healing for Suzanne's hip. Because, you know, in times like this, we all got to pull together. You have been really mm -hmm. amazingly uh, brave about this, but it is hard. You have a lot of energy mm -hmm. and you're so healthy otherwise. This has been really hard for you. Thank you. So I'm just going to ask Bye. everyone. To Thank please you. I appreciate it. Send a, send a prayer and just send some healing love to Suzanne's hip. Mm, thank you. Yeah. I love you all. Uh, yeah, we love you guys. We'll thank be back tomorrow at 11 a.m. Pacific. Mm, that was From nice. our bed. Are you going to make the bed or not? No. I don't like it when you make the bed. <laughs> please have your skanky makeup on in the morning. <laughs> okay. Don't Sit. wash your face. Okay. All right. Caution. Let's no. pretend like you stayed out at Oscar parties okay. all night until all right. 5 a.m. And the hat You were dancing be... with Elton John. Yeah. Dancing yeah. with Elton John? I'd yeah, you're at the Elton John that party. That was Does a fun party. Yeah. It's yeah. amazing. The party, we always get there too late, and then they stopped inviting us because we went to the Vanity Fair first. Then we walked across the street to Elton John's, and then one year we weren't on the list. Mm. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that All was right. good news. Anyway. No, it wasn't. That's a great party. We'll see He's you tomorrow morning with Skanky Makeup. Bye, Bye, guys.